is Acadiana's News Channel at 10. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jim Hummel. And I'm Marcel Fontenot. The Homewood Detention Pond Project will soon re resume after a settlement between LCG and the property owners. As we first reported earlier today, LCG settled for $11.5 million to buy the property from the Bendel Family Partnership. The project has been stalled for nearly a year amid court challenges. But tonight, those who live nearby have mixed feelings about the work getting back underway. Christina Mondragon joins us live with their story. Christina. Hi, Marcel. Retired teacher and homeowner since 1994, Donna Augustine, picked her lot specifically to build her home on River Ridge Drive for the peace and quiet. But all that changed when construction began and never finished. It was next to this nature area and quiet, and we lost that a year or so ago. Neighbors are also concerned with the uptake of pests and the pesticides being sprayed right by their houses. This is not good. It's going to be bad this summer. Mosquitoes are bad, um, and the spraying is not healthy for us. This is just ugly. Augustine is somewhat relieved that the settlement is resolved, but now just wants the Lafayette Consolidated Government to commit to maintaining the land. Well, I'm glad there's going to be some resolution to it, um, whether it's, I hope that they come now and, and repair what damage they've done and, you know, clean it up. KTC reached out to the LCG for comments about future plans for the construction, but have yet to hear anything back. Live in Lafayette, Christina Mondragon, KTC TV3. Now, according to LCG, the $11.5 million settlement is being paid for with American Rescue Plan Act funds. You might remember LCG hired Deloitte, a national accounting and consulting firm, to supervise how COVID relief funds are administered. We did reach out to LCG CAO Sidra Wingarder to see if Deloitte had signed off on using the funds for the settlement. She tells us yes. Next tonight.